Hello everyone, Richard back. I wanted to start a new playthrough of Grand Campaign West to complement uh, my ultimate playthrough I'm doing with Goose and my uh, Grand Campaign East with the Doctor's Mod and so on. Uh, I wanted to do it because I th wanted to take a different path from Idlecles. I also wanted to roleplay with an historic core a bit more. I think it'll be a lot more challenging. I would kind of like to mimic the defeat of the Germans in the West. And I think if I play with 25% prestige with Deductor's Mod, that will be very easy. <laughs> I'm, I'm probably not getting a decisive victory every scenario. Uh, I want to religiously deploy uh, uh, two Panzer Divisions of a certain makeup starting in 44. And I just wanted to like roleplay that, and I'm just curious how hard it would be. Uh, so we'll get into that. Uh, let's do a new game. We want this. Let's custom, prestige, and the AI level. And we're good. <clears throat> I will import my core. May, March 28th, 1942. Congratulations on your new command, Herr General. I am certain that you will perform your duties and lead your men with the utmost ability. As your General Field Marshal, I will keep you informed of your objectives and share intelligence with you as it becomes available during these briefings. Speaking of which, shall we begin your briefing now? I must say I was somewhat confused by your transfer orders, but if you truly have arrived here from the Eastern Front, I'm certain that your hand-picked veterans will serve you well. If you began this campaign with a force imported from Grand Campaign 41, you will only be able to import nine of, nine of these units and your prestige will be reset. SE units are not counted towards this total. The remaining units are considered to have stayed on the Eastern Front. Now then, as the war in the East and Africa continues, not all have been quiet here in the West. In the past, numerous probing attacks from British commandos have caused some irritating damage. While this is of no great concern, it is obvious that these attacks will only continue to grow in size and scope, and so they must be addressed. This is where you come in. As the commanding officer of our secret task force, it falls upon you to respond to and eliminate the threat posed by these commando raids, as the ongoing war on other fronts is already placing heavy demand on Germany's industry, however, the supply of equipment you may receive may be of second-hand nature. Even so, you must strive to do your best with the cards you've been dealt. Your first task is to defend the French port of Saint-Nazaire. Double agents have leaked intelligence pointing to a major enemy operation aimed at Saint-Nazaire, and we, should, we need you to stop it. Your objectives are to protect the Normandy dock and all docked U-boats within the harbor. Good luck, Herr General. I trust you will fulfill your duty. Brilliantly. SE unit limit for this campaign is 4. Experience limit is set at 425. Okay. So, we get some new units. Okay, so um, you're probably wondering, well, how are you going to do an historic core when you have so few slots? Well, I'm going to build up uh, both of the divisions in 1942-43. So, um, it's not going to, strictly speaking, be too historic, I think. For most of the campaign but I do plan on having a structure that's um, four infantry battalions and three tank battalions or regiments one anti-tank and four artillery pieces and the artillery will be a stug that will become a stug four later a 10 centimeter gun a 15 centimeter gun and rocket artillery oh uh, that's the plan and there are a bunch of units that are given to you through the Grand Campaign, so I don't have to buy any anti-tank weapons, I do not have to buy any Grenadiers, uh, I do not have to buy any Scouts, uh, I'm not going to deploy any airplanes because I'm going to be given, I think, enough airplanes. I'll get into that in a second. So none of my Air Force is going to be deployed, Rudel is, is being left at home, uh, none of my non-SE tanks are coming, I don't need them. Uh, let's see. And I think there's a bunch of other things. I'm going to get a really nice anti-aircraft gun later. So, so I'm going to basically deploy a division in this scenario. You'll see that. The, the, the difference will be I'll have a SE tank functioning as my anti-tank. Um, and then I have a division. So who am I bringing? Um, Oladir, which is going to stay as a pioneer. Where is he? Right here. Uh, I'm going to bring him. I'm not going to put him here because he moves so fast. I think I want Ola Deer swinging in this way. I'm going to bring my other Pioneers. Um, they're going to 
be here. I'm going to bring mountain units. So my four infantry regiments will have a pioneer group, a mountaineer group, and two Weimark infantry. That's the plan. And I want mountaineers because I think there's a lot of close fighting. Um, I do not want them to have transports because that affects their movement ability. He can go here. He can go here. Okay. Actually, I might want a tank over here as well. One second. Oh, my tanks. Um, I can over-strengthen those. Those are SE. Probably leave my strongest tank over here. Um, I also want to take my attack plus three artillery, this one, and I want to over-strengthen it and upgrade to a 15th centimeter. So my artillery will consist of, for each division, uh, a 15 centimeter, a 10 centimeter rocket, and a stug of some kind. My best range plus one, whoever has the most kills, 457, the most kills becomes upgraded to a stug. I don't think it preserves over strength. I want one stug to help with mobile operations. Yeah, you lose over strength. This stug, of course, will be over here. Uh, movement plus one will stay as rocket. And I want that unit. I want to have rocket over here. Yeah, I want rocket artillery over here. Um, and I need a 10 centimeter. I'm going to bring my range plus one 10 centimeter. And I'll put it over here to help with this group. Okay, and then two more tanks. So the, the tanks, oh, and an 88 gun. I'll bring my defense plus three 88 gun. I think I need that over here. Um, I'll tell you what, um, the 15 centimeter, whoops, I think I'm going to have the 15 centimeter travel this way. Where's my rocket artillery? Movement plus one. My rock. I'm gonna do a withdrawal here, but I want an 88 gun. Um, want an 88 gun here? Where'd my rocket artillery go? And I want. I want to kind of pull back as much as I can, um, because if you read the conditions. Defend Normandy Dock and all U-boats survive, right? So I need all of these guys to survive. Um, so I'm going to... Is Ola Deer... Did I bring my mountain troops? Where's my other mountain troops? Oh, here they are. Um, I think my mountain troops don't have trucks, so I'm going to actually rearrange this. I want uh, one troop to kind of go down here. Maybe my pioneers. This is a better idea. Um, pioneers have trucks, so... I want this mobile group to immediately go south and keep an eye on this. One of my Crotchetson will also go that way. And uh, actually, I have a much better idea. He has a truck. Let's pull him far from the front. He's going to help clean up that area. And then Oladir is going to immediately head south and guard these docks. Okay. 
tanks. Um, I'm going to upgrade all of them to Panzer IVs. There's no future for the Panzer threes. They also lose experience, as you can see. Um, so they're going to be below two stars. Yep. Uh, da, 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 da. And I have one more SE. I think it might be nice to send one tank this way. My, I'll, I'll send my best tank that way. Oh, I should also over-strengthen them while I can. Yeah, let's do that. A little bit of help on inexperienced tanks would not be such a bad thing. Hello. Thank you. Deploy, please. And I'll send my best tank. Yeah, I have no scouts either. I want to kind of rush this way to help. I want one armored unit. Okay. Let's see what happens. So you have, have some, some ships. ships. So there's units coming. <clears throat> so my entire front is broken, so I'm going to withdraw. I want to do an ordered withdrawal. Um, They're going, going for the U-boats, right? right? I, I need, need to, to cut, cut these guys, guys off. <clears throat> I, I need to swing out wide. I need to rush. Because they're going for these boats. I don't, I don't think, think they're, they're here yet. yet. So, so I can, can use a tank to block them, them. and then, then I want to do an ordered withdrawal. Um, Ola Deer, yeah. I, I might need to keep Ola Deer, deer actually. Um, I, can I can sacrifice the AA if necessary. necessary. They can reach me. One, two, three. I'm going to kind of hide and then bring my AAN. Okay. Let's scout. Oh, how's my soft cap? Oh, I didn't break soft cap. That's good. Okay, um, keep my AA there, Let's see what happens.
Uh, yeah, there's a lot of planes, so I'm going to do a defensive action. I don't have any Air Force, so I need to do an ordered withdrawal. Interesting. They're coming. But I also have armor coming. That's going to help. I think this is probably the trickier point. Um... Maybe Oladir can kill him. Yes. Okay. Okay, how do I defend this position? I think I would draw like this. I want Oladir. Okay, this is good. This kind of position is a lot better. Um, gonna move up. I'm protecting, uh, one second. How far can he move? Seven. So one, two, three, four. Those level bombers might hurt me. That's the only problem. At least the infantry can't reach. I don't know where this guy's going. Okay, we're gonna just hold out. Maybe that plane will go away. Um, Let's continue scouting. Need to get my artillery down there. Um, I'm going to build a screen for my artillery. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. That's it. They're coming. I know they're coming. <clears throat> I need to do another ordered withdrawal. Um, I can't see anything. Okay. They're trying to get in here. Um, my tank could go where? Here? 
Where can my tanks go? Here? How far can my stud go? This is a range plus one stug. Um, what's the decisive again? Defend and, and all U-boats survive. So these guys can be lost. It's this. Maybe maybe I need to have Oladir in this region. Well... I just need to figure out how to defend. Um, I might want somebody over here. I think I need him to stay like this. Um, I've got this choke point established. So I'm going to guard this region with Oladir. They can't just break in here. My stug is inexperienced. They are also inexperienced. I have to go here. Okay, I don't see anything. Let's see what happens. Wow, they're attacking my anti-air. That's kind of funny. Ouch. Probably should have retreated that. Uh, there are reports of Allied commandos already inside St. Zair Harbor. Defend the Normandy Dog. Yeah, I know. I don't see anything, though. Okay, let's kill this guy. I like my odds. Ah, come on. I didn't want it to retreat and I had very good suppression there. All right. 
Not useless, can still do damage. I think I have a chance of taking that out. Nope. I'm just really confused. Where are these units? <clears throat> right? Like, they say there's stuff hanging around, and I don't see it. Okay, strongest tank. Okay. This guy's gonna go right here. can't put the tanks in the city. Why? That That's just clearly a bad idea. These, These are, are not mountain, mountain troops, so, well, so, so my back door is actually safer than you think. think. Okay. Where, Where the hell, hell are these troops? troops? Oh, oh crap, crap, I forgot, I forgot about, about the subs. Because I was dealing, dealing with... What, what the fuck? fuck? Where, Where did those guys, guys come, come from? from? How, How did the, the paratroopers end up there? there? What? Oh no, they, they have, have artillery support, support that they're bringing. bringing. Okay, okay, I, I forgot, forgot that uh, I, I need to defend, defend this region. region. So, so we shall defend, defend this region. Put a tank here, okay. Um, let's kill this. Those are four star. Oh my god. Uh,
This is crazy. I think I need more infantry over here. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm... What the hell? There's all this crap everywhere. Um, the submarine's in danger. So... That's good. I had to do that to protect the sub. Um, can I actually retreat out of this? Oh, God, no. I wanted to go here. I'm trying to build a defensive wall. Um, I have to keep my infantry here to block uh, the other infantry from reaching my tanks. Okay. And I have four paratroopers. Wow. I will bring over that Crotchetson to help. All right. Oh, my fort really helped. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I just don't have enough troops to cover everything. this? Sure. I need to immediately get that tank out of there. Um, I don't see anything. The Air Force seems to have disappeared. I think that's okay. I don't think they can get in. Um, I don't think there's any, inf I don't see anything. So I think it's safe for me to do this. Maybe I can kill this infantry unit. Um, Oh god, no. That was not what I was trying to do. 
Fuck. I was trying to move my freaking infantry. Let me reload that turn. That was, uh, I can't afford a mistake like that. It's really aggravating. I was trying to move my infantry in there, and for some reason my artillery piece went in there. Okay, I put my tank... Oh, Jesus, that's not what I'm trying to do. Game, come on. It has this weird delayed reaction. I've seen it actually happen to a lot of other players as well. Uh, it It's like you do an action and then it uh, remembers it several seconds after you did it, even though nothing is happening. Okay. Let's try this again. I wanted my I wanted my um infantry here. That's what I wanted. <clears throat> I want to retreat like this. That's what I wanted. Okay. Then I wanted this guy out of my face. Okay, um, no, I could just do it like this. I just realized what the problem is. I want to keep my strong panzer here. I don't have any anti-aircraft protection here. That is a problem. Okay, uh, I have so many problems. Can I disband? Yeah. I need this guy to die. I have to defend the docks, right? Yeah. I'm gonna do it. I have vision, so I think there's. This is all. This is all of the uh, paratroopers left.
they can see my tank, that's unfortunate. I have triple. It's it's actually really funny. I have triple anti-air on that. Yep, I have to kill this one. <clears throat> there I'm glad I have my rocket artillery over here because it's a deterrent from the enemy. Okay. Time for you to die. Oh, it's cloudy. That really sucks. However, because it's cloudy... Um, the the enemy's planes are much less effective, especially level bombers. Okay, let's bring you over. He's going to try to hit the... I think I want to kill this one. Perfect. So my plan is very simple. <laughs> I'm going to withdraw. So everybody has artillery protection. I have to protect, I have to worry about my back door here. They haven't taken this, this objective yet. Um, okay. Yep, I knew that was happening. <clears throat> I needed to do that, so this is a very weak infantry now. Resupply. On my back door. So I'm going to try to protect against an incursion. I probably, yeah, I have to protect against an incursion and protect my stug. Okay. I don't, I don't have, have any scouting. scouting, it's kind, kind of a problem. Oladir's fine. So, so I, think I think these two harbors, harbors are protected, but... I'm not sure. Okay, let's, let's end, end my turn. turn. We're, We're halfway, halfway there. there. Yeah. yeah.
Oh, right. I'm defending, so they had a clear day. Okay. Okay, this is really exciting when you're defending instead of attacking. Let's attack. Hopefully my crotchets in can finish this off. Decisive is defend the docks, which I think means get all these objectives, and then uh, don't lose any U-boats. I don't think I can save the supply dumps. Okay. Okay, I did that so I can resupply Oladir, who's really strong. Okay. How much? I got six ammo. That's really good. Tired of this artillery piece. We move up. I'm going to move up to protect my units. That guy, I can probably take care of next turn. Made you weaker. I still have nice zone of control here. Um, I think it would be a good idea to resupply. There's probably going to be another attack. Uh, let's offer this as bait to the pioneers. Okay. <clears throat> let's see what happens. Perfect. I think that's the last of the enemy units. Um, how dug in is he? Three?
Let's hit him again. Perfectly suppress. Watch this slick move. He can't resupply or reinforce. He'll attack that almost certainly. Um. Good hit. The plane is down. Now I want to try to kill that if I can. grab this objective. Okay. It's empty. Let's see if I'll be punished for my aggression. Okay, my poor tank. Oh. My Crouchitson are really helping out down here. I needed both of them. All right, um, I might be able to, f I gotta go. So I will show you the exciting conclu conclusion of this first scenario later. Richard out.